I was under the impression that we were working Monday off Tuesday work, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. But they had an emergency meeting. When was it? Thursday? And said that it would just not be worth it to open up for one day. So we get Monday off too. And I hurt myself. Um, Thursday I wasn't there for the meeting because I was only at work for half an hour. And they sent me to go to urgent care. Because my wrist was really hurting and it had fallen asleep at night and that sort of thing and there's people racing in boats so there's wait for it there he goes and there's one coming right there ah so Anyways, any user. Um, so my hand had been falling asleep at night and it wakes me up and everything at night. And I went in and my hand had been asleep for about four or five hours. So uh, my boss asked me what was wrong and I kept telling him nothing, you know. It's not anything really that is alarming or anything like that. But I just... I didn't want to be sent home or anything, um, but he ended up having me go to urgent care because your hand falling asleep is obviously not something to mess with because it could lead, it could be underlying to other problems. So he told me to go to urgent care and get it all looked at and everything, and so I did, and they said I have carpal tunnel. I have to wear this brace thing at work and even at home until next Thursday or Friday and I have to wear it like 24-7 unless there's something I'm doing like getting a shower or maybe um, doing dishes or you know something that I can't use just my fingers for I have to use my whole hand so yeah even at work I have to wear it and It's been hard. Um, I called him and asked if he wanted me to come back in on Thursday. And he said, no, go home, just relax and everything. So that's what I did. And then yesterday was Friday, so today is Saturday. And I have off today, tomorrow, and Monday and Tuesday. So um, not sure what we're doing this weekend, if we are doing anything. But, yeah, I guess I will find out here in a couple of days, really. Um, we might be going over to my brother-in-law's and sister-in-law's house and uh, having a 4th of July party there, but we're not 100% sure. Um, depends on if our landlord needs Tim to work this weekend. So, I gotta get the dishes put away, but, yeah just been today I have just been sleeping like all day no shame I've been so tired from work and Friday we had to go to my brother-in-law's house he fixed our car for us uh, we had to get the brake rotor and the caliper changed on the driver's or the passenger side front wheel um, it's been giving us problems. The other day I was on my way to work and I felt the brakes and they were really stiff compared to before. So um, I, my fiance just told me, you know, I called him up. I was like, hey, I, I don't know what's going on. And he told me just to use the brakes as little as possible and like don't be slamming on the brakes or whatever, which I don't usually do unless someone like pulls out in front of me or whatever. But I drove to work and then the next day is was Thursday so I drove to work to urgent care and then back home all within like two hours and halfway home it started grinding really bad and um, that's we knew it was the caliper sticking and everything so we had to go Friday we went 
we left here about 8 o'clock in the morning and mind you I didn't get to sleep until like 5 so I was running on three hours of sleep and everything went smoothly with the uh, changing of everything but uh, one of my brother-in-law's friends stopped and they were talking and I was inside with the baby and just hanging out and everything and my my treat to them for fixing the car was I took them all out for ice cream and my fiance gave them 20 bucks just to, you know as a little thank you for helping us out and everything uh, so that's what we did and I didn't get home until it was like 145 I had run over and checked my P.O. box and got it all figured out and everything and by the time I got home it was like 1.40 or 1.30 or something like that and I leave for work at 2 and I had to get changed for work, I had to pack my lunch and by that time it was like 1.50 and I just didn't have time to do anything or even get a little nap in so I went to work and worked for eight hours by myself in seclusion back in the middle of BFE at work um, I looked at parts and boxes all night for eight hours and it was really hot and if I get really hot I get tired so I was just I was falling asleep at work and everything and I ended up passing out around two last night when I got home and I've been sleeping off and on all day. Uh, we woke up at like 11 and or it was closer to 10, 9 30, 10 o'clock or something. Uh, so we woke up and we had a package over at the post office so we went over and got that, came home. He opened it and everything because it was his stuff. Um, then we I come back home and we had the AC on and I got really comfortable because it's been hot and humid in here so I got comfortable and I ended up falling asleep. I woke up for about an hour and watched a little bit of YouTube and then I zonked back out for another couple of hours and got up, watched some YouTube, uh, went and filmed the Wish App haul part one I guess. Uh, it will all be in one big collaboration though. And, yeah, that's what I've been doing all day. Sitting, and I actually got two loads of laundry going. One's in the washer, one's in the dryer, so that's going. But, yeah, this four-day weekend, I'm just going to sit and relax and not do anything. Because I keep getting taken out of my house, and, I mean, it's not a bad thing. I went to go see my mother-in-law up in the hospital, but... I don't have any me time anymore so today I've just been sitting and relaxing and not doing a darn thing because I just wanted to relax and catch up on my sleep so Rocko! Rocko! Hi Rocko! Okay, okay. You sound like a piggy. Come on, back up. Back up. Back up. Come on. Excited? Yeah. He's excited, so am I. Shut the door. 
top one. Oh yeah, the camera it does. But you can see like each individual color, the color thingy. There you go.
What do you mean, did I get mine? Of the thing down there? Yeah. Wow! Sit here with this handsome fella. He's so handsome. We are waiting for the fireworks. The helicopter was fun. Somebody's tired. It's been a long day. <laughs> I am pretty tired, but yep. What time is it? It's almost 9:30. Fireworks start at 10. Right around 10. So, so about half an hour to go. Maybe we'll set an alarm and get a little 25-minute cat nap. <laughs> But, probably not. But, then after the fireworks, we're going to go in and find some food. Because y'all know we need to eat. Yeah, y'all. This handsome face. He's warming up, you know. But. Sure was. That's cool. Just got done with the fireworks. I think I'm gonna add those into their own separate little video, but add a little snippet into this because it was like a, almost a half an hour long show. But ten seconds short of half an hour. Yeah, do you hear them? Ten seconds short from half an hour. That was a good, good pick for fireworks there. Huh. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> so now we just gotta get out of this cluster that we call traffic. But other than that, it's been an all-in-all -all good day. Hi, everybody. So 
it's like 9.30 at night. Um, I just pretty much jumped on. I went out to my sister's, I guess you could call her my sister. Um, she's technically my sister-in-law. We I just went out to her house today and just hung out and we had like a little cookout and little get together. So that was today. Um, got home about half an hour ago and then I was like, crap, I need to get the vlog up. So um, I just wanted to come on and say happy 4th of July 2017 to everybody. And pretty much just to end the vlog because I usually don't really end it. Um, but there will be a separate video uploaded after this. Um, so after my vlog of just the fireworks, because they were like a half an hour long display, firework display on Saturday. So I just wanted to add that into its own video. I will add a, like there will have been a snippet in the vlog here, but that wasn't nearly all of it. But I did get some sun this weekend, but yeah, so... I will see you guys all hopefully next week. And yeah, so bye guys.